So first is of course my flower, water, sometimes you must use a little bit more of water or a little bit more of flower, this is depends. Finally I will, I will know how to do it. And it's like pancakes. A little bit, yeah, for, for, for the beginning, but later it's a little bit different, yeah. Of course, we have different types of uh, dumplings in the world. We have some dumplings, actually, and the other dumplings. Yeah. We have some ravioli in Italy. This is a little bit different, uh, different dough, actually. And now we must everything mash together, actually. Uh, this is Russian stuffing, yeah. This is actually only for, uh, for uh, ingredients. This is something like mashed potato, cottage cheese, fried onion, salt and pepper. Yes, this is a uh, boiled potato mixed together with mm -hmm. this. What we ate now? Uh, yes, one. yes, we ate uh, yeah. Russian dumplings, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. How now. quick! Yes. <laughs> uh, when dough is ready, actually, and uh, it's uh, not sticking in your, our hand, you must uh, put on the parsley bro. Yes. And a little bit you squeeze. Couple times. Okay, okay, well, okay. uh, Russian dumplings is the most popular in Ukraine. Yeah. Yes. The different name of these dumplings is Dalishan. Some, some Dalishan, Dalishan. Yes. yes. Okay. In our restaurant, we have uh, three types. Yes, you eat with with the mushroom sauce and some with a certain kind of mushroom. Yeah. And uh, with uh, Russian stuff. And now, when dough is ready, you need another uh, one glass, and you must uh, prepare. Something. Okay. You can twist two times because it's just a little bit easier for you. No, uh, no. <laughs> uh, in Russian we have something like dumplings with potato. Okay. And uh, we prefer something a little bit the same, but, but we have twist. yes, we have also some uh, okay. uh, cheese inside, cottage cheese. And now when you take a piece of dough, you must put a little bit of uh, stuffing inside, yeah. A pani będą robiły, czy nie? Oczywiście mogą pani spróbować. Ja myślę, że tak. Yes, and you must, you can stretch a little bit piece of the dough. And next you must everything uh, edges together. Yes, Dominika uh, make a uh, beautiful dumpling. <laughs> So they are all different. And the last step uh, is uh, boiling, yeah? So you must uh, boil water and put it inside and wait something like four or five uh, minutes. Some meat, uszka uh, in Polish uh, with meat. So it's tiny dumplings. But to the end, you must stir the bread. Of course, you prefer, you can prepare different size of them.